Well, everybody, I hope you can see me. Today is Old McDonald's last day on the farm. Um, I'm going to walk you through the chicken coops and to see the pigs and see where I've spent my vacation. I'm going to spin you around and uh, show you the chickens. Bye, chickens and roosters. My husband got bit by a wasp. Let's see if I could zoom in. Maybe I could go through the top. I don't know. Yeah, but this is actually... There's a little baby chick right there. I am literally, like, here's my finger. So I'm literally, like, probably eh, three feet, four feet from these guys. And when we wanted eggs, oops, when we wanted eggs, we would co literally come out here to the chicken coop and get eggs. So that's the chicken coop. Uh, now I'm going to walk over to where the pigs are. And I have to walk very quickly because it's hot. When I say hot, I think it's like 85 degrees and it's in the morning. Now I see why farmers and stuff are outside at like freaking 5 in the morning or whatever because after 9 o'clock, it's just hot. Um, that's an old car. I don't know if you can see that. An old car on our property. I'm going to spin around this way. That's an old um, like an old cast iron stove and that like right there is the garden um, that's the house and some of the sheds and the chicken coop is behind the clothesline um, hey there's our car and my husband and my son putting our stuff in our car uh, I'm gonna walk back to the pigs I, I don't know yardage and stuff uh, but I'm a city girl, so it seems like I'm walking a mile. <laughs> but uh, if you can just imagine, if they clear the brush, look how tall the... I mean, these trees are probably as tall as like a small apartment building or something. Uh, I mean, they're really, really tall. Uh, there's a tree. If I have... If I don't pass out from the heat, I'll show you a tree that was knocked over from Katrina. It was a huge tree, and it's literally just laying on its side uh, now I'm walking back to now here's the thing the shot might get a little crazy because I'm looking through the lens of this thing but I need to watch my feet and see like what's on the ground so I'm not trying to have any surprise <laughs> so although I'm trying to keep the camera steady I'm looking down because I don't need nothing creeping and crawling past my feet now, when I was here last year, the pigs were small. I don't know what they look like now. This is my first time back here. Um, oh my God, the smell. Woo, Jesus. Oof. Oh Lord. See, y'all know I'm such a city girl. Oh my God. This will make you never want to eat bacon again in your life. Oh my God, the smell. Jesus. This is exactly why. I ain't come back here this year. Whew. Um, oof, the flies. This is definitely country living. Last year when we were here, they were, um, oh my lord, small. Mm, 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 mm. I don't know if y'all can hear it. Oh my god, it's huge. And I guess the mama saw me coming. And, um, she moved so the babies could, and the babies got mad. Stop feeding them, but you can see oh, oof, how big they are. So, I guess this is literally you can hear them, right? These things weren't here, like these um fresh chest freezers, but I guess they're so huge. I'm trying to get closer, but y'all know I ain't trying to. I mean, they look like little elephants or something. I don't even know. Like, I feel like I'm at a zoo. But anyway, that's enough for me. Oof. I've been back here. Oof. Ooh, the stench. I guess I'm just a city girl. <laughs> that's all I can tell everybody. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a city girl. Um, they were cute when I was here last year. Here's another route. Like, if you cut through, you can see the path. It takes you to another piece of the property. I mean, the, the property that we're on is huge. I mean, it's just massive and massive. 
And thank God, like, the pigs are not by the house. <laughs> Whew, thank you, God, that the pigs are not by the house. But, uh, now I'm walking back to the house. And, uh, this is cool. I could kind of, I mean, it's really pretty. Like, if you can just imagine, man, in New York, they probably put, like, 50 buildings in a shopping mall on this property. So I'm walking back now towards the house. I saw armadillos on the property. I saw rabbits. I saw everything. So I guess this is cool for like a week <laughs> or a couple days. Anything more than that, uh, I don't know. I don't think I could take. It's, it's uh, I don't know if nostalgic is the right word, but it's cute, you know, for a couple days. But there, here's some of the tractors that's on the other side of the, um, this is like, uh, this is like a barrier or something right here. But the garden is right on the other side where there's peppers and okra and um, tomatoes. And there's the tractors right there because you can't like just go to Home Depot and get a lawnmower. These trees are so cool. It's like trees you see in California because it's so hot. Um, but here's actually a corn stock where you can just go right out in your backyard and get corn. See, I'm not daring, so I'm not kind of trying to walk through this to get to the garden. They usually get through the garden on the other side. But there's tractors. And this tree, I'll just show you something. What you're looking at right now is the base of a tree. Now, this tree this part of the tree used to be there in the ground so literally this part used to be like this so it was knocked down from the root and it's just laying horizontally i don't know if it's really expensive to take it down but it probably stands i don't know i'm like five feet this thing probably stands like 15 feet in the air at, at least maybe even 20 feet because here's some like shrubbery right here which are weeds for, for the most part and that's at least six feet tall but it's like here you're seeing it. this is literally the root and base of the tree and how it's just like all I could say is that it's horizontal where it used to be vertical so it used to kind of be this way and now it's that way because it was just I mean it's amazing it's just lifted out of the ground but anyway there's uh, we have pear trees here's where we kind of sat under the tree and uh, you know it's just really pretty here's like a small just like a small bed of flowers and you can kind of, I'll show you how far we are from the road. I don't know if you can, I mean, it's really far. That's the road. Oh, there's a truck passing by, but it's really far. So anyway, that's where I kind of hung out. So I'll show you the next video at our next city that we're going to. And uh, thanks for watching. I don't know if you guys can see me. Bye.